Good morning everyone, welcome back to Saving with Van and Nighty. If this is the first time you're watching my channel, welcome to my channel. I hope you like my content and that you may consider subscribing. I do all things cash budgeting for bills, expenses, sinking funds, which are like emergency fund, vacations fund, back to school, unexpected items, and I also do saving challenges. So for today, we will be doing our bills for the pay period of April 21st to September the 3rd, as well as our expenses for these two weeks. So bienvenidos a mi canal, Saving with One in 90. Es un placer tenerlos aquí. Um, hago todo tipo de videos que tengan que ver con relleno de sobres para mis biles, para, mi, para mis pagos. Para mis biles, mis pagos, mis gastos de la semana, de la quincena, al igual que también um, hago ahorros para el fondo de emergencia, fondo médico, para vacaciones y retos de ahorro. So, si esto es algo que creen que les interese, por favor sigan viendo y espero um, tomen en cuenta suscribirse. So before we start the video, I want to make sure to send out the, the shout outs to hashtag BCL round two budgeters of the week. And we have Sav Saves, Nixter Budgets, Ang Budgets and Deb, and Jasmine Budgets. Please make sure to go check out these wonderful channels. Go and play their playlists so you could get to learn a little bit more about them and help them also at the same time gain watch hours and as well check out their Etsy shop if they have one. I will leave down the links in the description. So to continue with, um, as you know, when we pay our bills, the first thing I use is my monthly planner to determine what I will be cash stuffing this two weeks. So, so this pay period runs from the 21st of August all this week and the following. It ends on September the 3rd because next payday is the 4th. So when we go back, that means for this week we had nothing and for next week we will have to pay our car insurance and our cell phone bill and that's it because we don't have nothing till the fifth which will be the next pay period so once again car insurance and cell phone bill so we go to our notebook here we have august pay period two bills our cell phone and our car insurance one is for 58 dollars the other one is for 86 which is a total of 144 that we will be cashing into our cash envelopes so estaba comentando que este es el calendario donde anoto todos mis biles, mis pagos del mes. So para este periodo que es del 21 de agosto hasta septiembre 3, tenemos que pagar la siguiente semana la aseguranza del carro y el celular y sería todo por esta quincena. So aquí están anotados, aquí están las cantidades que es un total de 144 dólares. So I have this envelope. So I have here the money and coupon. So for today, we will be cash stuffing. 50 and 50 is 100, 20, 40, 60, 80, 200, 20, 40, 60. So 260, 270, 80, 280, 290, 300, 310, 20, 30, 330, 331, 2, 3, 4. So, un total de 334 estaremos um, utilizando hoy para pagar nuestros pagos de este mes, al igual que rellenar nuestros sobres de gastos de la quincena. So, we're going to put this to the side already. And once again, we're just going to cash the 144 for our bills. So, here's our bills and expenses binder. So we have here 50 and 50, it's 100, 120, 140, 1, 2, 3, 4. So 144, poner en nuestro sobre de pagos. So to check how much we have left, we start with our Grand total, which for this by week period, it's 725. So we do that. 
We're going to do 725 minus 144. That's going to leave us with a total of 581 left. So 581 left after paying our bills. So here's a breakdown of my expenses. So we'll be stuffing my gas, my grocery, eating out, miscellaneous, me, myself, and I, which is my envelope, Costco, and bless others. When we cash stuff out of envelopes, we should have a total of 290 left. So let's get stuffing. Before we continue, I want to show you guys. Um, I will be also stuffing. I got several coupons on the mill this time. I have some for Pollo Loco. Some for Yoshinoya, and I like these because there's two bowls for 11. The meal deal that comes with egg rolls. Then there's the combo bowls for 13, so I think it's a really good price. For Burger King, I got many. I already had some and I got a lot, so I'm gonna be giving some out um, to my sister-in-law and to my brother. And then I also got some for JC Penny, which I don't think I may buy something because I don't need nothing, but I'll just save on some. I'll put these on the back. So, estaba compartiendo que recibí muchos cupones para para restaurantes como Burger King, para Yoshinoya, para Pollo Loco y para la tienda de JC Penny. So, no tengo planeado comprar nada, pero lo vamos a guardar por cualquier cosa. Okay, so we're gonna continue cash stuffing. So now we will be doing our gas. So for gas, we will be doing 40. And so if you have not been following me and this is the first time you're watching me, I have explained before that the reason why I only put $40 um, for gas is because my husband borrows the car on the weekend because he goes play soccer. So he uses a car and we made an agreement that he could use it to do all the stuff he needs, but I need him to help me pump gas again to the car because I, I need the car with gas for the whole week. So, so he usually adds gas halfway tank so that's why I've been I've been able to just continue adding forty dollars. So estaba explicando que la razón que solo agrego cuarenta dólares para gasolina para el carro es porque mi esposo juega fútbol los domingos. So, so hicimos un acuerdo de que él agregue gasolina al carro para que yo tenga para la semana. So por eso es que he estado pudiendo poner cuarenta. Okay. Okay. Groceries. Grocery, I put down here in the budget breakdown that we're adding 160 as I have been adding. But I'm um, behind three days on uploading this video. So I already went grocery shopping and I spent 100. So that means that the difference is $60. So that's what I will be adding today. $60 for a total of 160 for these two weeks. So estaba explicando que um, aquí tengo anotado en mi papelito 160 por la razón que es lo que estoy um, bueno, gastando de marqueta. Um, pero este video está tres días tarde, so yo ya gasté 100 dólares, so ya no más restan 60 dólares en la marqueta. Ok, so next we will be doing eating out. For eating out, we will be adding 45, so we have 20, 30, 40, and 5. So para comer fuera, estamos agregando la cantidad de 45 dólares. So along with the money, we will be adding, of course, our coupons to Burger King to Yoshinoya and to El Pollo Loco. And these I will leave outside because once, as, once again, I said I was gonna give them out because I don't need that many. Okay, so next we have miscellaneous for miscellaneous. Um, that's for anything I wanna buy that is not in my other envelopes, anything. Um, we will be adding $10 today. So, para miscellaneous, que es cualquier cosa que queramos comprar, agregamos un total de 10 dólares. Next is my envelope. So, for myself, I still have 15 dollars that were gifted to me by Hop Into Budget with Bunny from the Buy Me A Coffee page. So, I still have those 15 in the bank and I will be adding 10 dollars today. So, tengo todavía 15 dólares en el banco que me... Um, Don, me regalaron aquí por el link de Buy Me A Coffee y también tengo 10 dólares que estamos agregando hoy. Self care, today we will not be adding anything. Costco, so Dream Big Budgets, I already added the label. Thank you so much, it looks so pretty. So for Costco today, 
we will be adding $20. So, para Costco, vamos a agregar un total de $20. Y este nuevo label que tengo aquí me lo regaló Dream Big Budgets. So, quedó muy bonito. So, for Costco, we now have $20, $30, $40. And yes, I'm using one hand because I'm carrying my baby with my other hand. <laughs> and you could hear him in the background. Angel in heaven, look how pretty. So I added the label that was made for me. And I also added some little flower stickers. So it looks so pretty. So this is for my baby in heaven. Um, I didn't spend the $10 because I gifted four roses arrangements from a wedding. Um, that they had that some said a family member had so we took those roses to the cemetery for my baby so I still have those ten dollars so um, la razón que todavía tengo estos diez dólares es porque um, un familiar tuvo una boda y le y me regalaron cuatro arreglos muy bonitos de rosas blancas y rojas o so se los llevamos al cementerio and bless others este es para bendecir a otras personas que tengan una necesidad. Today we will be adding five dollars. Okay, so we're done cash stuffing. So now we're going to check how much money we're going to have left. So after paying our bills, we had a total of 581 here. And after, and we added 290 into our expenses. So minus 290 we should have left over 291 to stuff our sinking funds and saving challenges and i always like to keep 100 for saving challenges so that means i should have 191 left to stuff my sinking funds and also to provide money uh to add to my kids envelopes so i hope you enjoyed this video and you may consider subscribing if you haven't for some reason, YouTube has been deleting some of my subscribers. One day I was down by two, another day I was down by six. Today, um, I see that my subscribers are back up to 429, so we'll see what happens. Um, so before we end this video, I wanna do um, some shout outs, as I mentioned. I wanna be shouting out different channels each week that are supporting me. So the shout out goes to Life on a Budget. She is new to YouTube, so make sure to go check out her videos like comment and subscribe if you like them she has a really good content my next shout out goes to praying cooking couple series they have amazing content they do lives where uh, you could request to have a prayer done for you this bling does on fridays fashion attire saturday morning cj vin dj vince talks about a topic and on sundays they do shout outs so make sure to go check out their channel and the next shout out goes to Sweet Ree. I love her channel. She, you could just feel the positive energy there. Uh, she does lives on Mondays and she also does lives on Thursdays, which is thanks for Thursdays. That's why I came across her channel and I enjoy watching her. She's always smiling. Lastly, for today's shout outs, we have Wanda Budgets. Go check out her channel. She has Monday morning walks where she always has a topic to discuss. So she also has videos where she is working out. So make sure to go check out these all these wonderful channels as well as the hashtag BCL channels mentioned. Hope you enjoyed today's content and see you in my next Thinking Funds video. Thank you. Bye bye.